Good afternoon, everyone. You see me smiling more because I really enjoy the weather. Today, tomorrow might be a different story. There's a very interesting weather in Michigan. Today, I'm going to make a Polish style dish, which is going to be a cauliflower, uh, zapikanka, in, in when you wanted to translate it into English, it's going to sound like cauliflower casserole. I'm going to tell you a little bit about my ingredients today, or maybe I should show you right away, so not to bore you guys. I have one head of cauliflower, one onion, can take cubes, a Parmesan uh, cheese. My cheese is homemade, and I made it from walnut, so it's healthy. All spice, garlic powder, using Oregon white pepper. I'm also going to use kale and yeah. sour cream. I will uh, boil my cauliflower for about only five minutes, no longer, because you make sure your cauliflower is a little bit undercooked because you don't want um, them too mushy. You know what? I forgot to do, I forgot the rinse there. So I'm going to break my cauliflower into florets. Simply going to just cut into half. Uh, so water in that. All right. Uh-oh. Okay. Now I'm going to place my cauliflower in the boiling water. Let's go. Cover that up. Now I'm going to cut my onions into small pieces. So I'm going, going uh, to transfer that into my baking pan. Here it is. My cauliflower is also ready. I'm going to add a little bit of liquid from cauliflower into my baking pan with onion. Just to give it a um, little start. All right. They're going to saute until they soft. Now I'm going to separate liquid from cauliflower and I will save that liquid of broth. Everything is ready now um, to create uh, this beautiful dish. So I will go ahead start with pouring in some vegan sour cream in my baking pan. Just a little bit. I don't want the cauliflower to stick to the bottom of, of my pan. Wow, that's nice. Here it is. Here's my cauliflower. So I'm going to go ahead and add it uh, with my baking pan. Now I'm going to add onions with that. This is oil-free dish. I'm trying not to add a lot of oil in my dishes anymore. I'm still uh, using oil, but not as much as I used to. Now I'm going to um, add tempeh. Now I'm going to add my Parmesan and I will add half of it here. So yeah, all right, here it is. Now, now I need to create some kind of socks, go with my uh, other ingredients. I going to use cup of broth. I just, um, that one I just cook cauliflower in. Okay, 
and here I have my thickening uh, agent, which is going to be flex seed. Uh, I have two tablespoons. All right. And with that, I'm going to add uh, my sour cream now. I am not sure how much I have it. Let me just measure. Oh, you just know. Okay, here it comes into my measurement cup. So it looks like it's one cup of it. Adding that right now. Okay. Let's go ahead and mix that. I'm mixing that right now. I'm going to add some oregano with that now. Allspice. White pepper. And garlic powder. And a bit of salt. I need to add my kale with that now. I think in like three cups of that. Adding my mixture with my other ingredients now. I'm going to sprinkle everything with rest of my Parmesan vegan cheese. Beauty is going in the oven now at 400 for about 25 to 30 minutes. Welcome back. My casserole is all ready. It looks a little bit um, different than I expected, but um, I'm going to taste that soon and I see um, how it is. Hopefully it's good. Kale seems to be um, crispy. That might be a really good thing. But again, I'm going to taste it and see for myself. I think it's going to be good. What do you think? Ooh. And this is what I'm going to eat. Big chunk of food. The best time of the cooking show. Wow, maybe this dish is not the best looking, but let me tell you about its taste. Absolutely delicious. Wow. This is great. This is absolutely amazing. About like about this dish is that it's uh, oil free. You don't really uh, need that much oil in your diet. You can use broth, you can use water to cook your veggies. And the steak is, is still is very good. That's what I'm doing recently. This is absolutely good. Polish style vegan casserole. Loving that. All my family is going to enjoy it. Before I know it, it's going to be gone. Most of the time, I don't have any leftovers. If I have leftovers, I will be like, wow, what is happening? I really hope that you like my recipe. Please like, like me and subscribe to my channel. If you enjoy my uh, cooking show today, don't forget to go vegan for animals. Have a great Saturday and Sunday. Actually, the, um, for us, there's a long weekend. Yeah, so I have, uh, actually, I have more than three days. I have four days because I have a Tuesday off also from work, so. Woohoo! All right. Uh, see you next time in my new video. Bye.